stuck with a water bill meant for other people. A Ruskin woman used to pay her water bill to her landlord, but when he passed away, she sent her money to the county water department. But then, just this week, she was told she has to pay the landlord's past due amount on another property, and she has to do it by Friday. Well, that's when she knew she had better call Shannon make it who joins me right now to tell us more about it you know you get these all the time a little something new every time yeah I tell this, you, is a, this is a different this is a different one it really caught my attention because I've never heard of having to pay someone else's yeah. bill after they pass away it just seems ridiculous and Lindsay Fernandez tells me that she was told if she didn't pay five hundred twenty four dollars her water well they were just gonna shut it off pretty much said there can be up to 20 properties. And Lindsay Fernandez was get stunned paid. to get a water bill so for $524.13, especially since most of this bill is for water used by strangers in other apartments owned by her landlord. I can't have my water cut off. But that's exactly what Hillsborough County's water department told her would happen if, if she didn't pay the full amount the by the shirt. end of the week. So, uh, I'm kind of stuck here because I have a family and I'm like, what's going on? How in the world does something like this happen? It all started when her landlord, Daniel Holst Sr., passed away last fall. Lindsay had paid her water bill to him. So she called the water department and asked for her own bill. But first, she explains she had to pay a past due amount for another apartment. I did that in October. I paid a past due balance that wasn't even our property. We came up with 150, 150. They broke up to date so we can continue to live here until we find another home. She paid monthly, and then bam, this big bill showed up. So they want yes. you to pay for someone yes. else's water? Yes. Yes. When she got nowhere on her own, she called me, and I called the county. But she doesn't feel, you know, obviously, that it's right for her to have to pay for someone else's water. It turns out the landlord's four apartments had one bill. This past due amount is for other units, and the county had no idea that the landlord wasn't paying because he passed away. Within hours, county workers changed their minds, letting Lindsay off the hook. So she'll only be charged for water that she uses. Now, a county spokeswoman tells me that the county will have to go through the, the court system to try to collect this past due amount through the landlord's estate. All right, so that's the water bill. You got that fixed, and that's yep. good news. But then there's this rent and you know, the landlord's passed away. Right, so they don't have to pay rent to anybody right now. They're just saving that money, putting it aside, and pay it, but waiting until there's someone to pay. And I checked the court records, and there is a foreclosure yeah. active right now, but you know, those things take a long time, so who knows when they'll finally foreclose. So they're just there, but, you know, at least the water part is taken care of. Yeah, all right. Well, thank you, Shannon. Yeah.